So hello and welcome to Dommy Tries This. I hope you brought your cuppa. Today's coffee mug is the Faith Mug from a set of four that I picked up from Kroger a few years back. They all have a different color and they have a different word that is written all over them. This one, like I said, is the Faith Mug and it's in red. And there is an orange Believe, a green one or a greenish one. And I can't remember the last one for some reason. Um, but I picked them up over time because they were like five or six dollars a peach piece. And um, but I love the set. Anyway, today's tea is Dash Tea's Mango Passion Fruit Herbal Tea. And I think I've had this a while back, but we're heading into warmer weather, so it seemed quite appropriate for the time. Can't remember how it tastes, and we're without milk today, so. It's going to taste a little different anyway. Let's go ahead and give it a sip and see how we like it without the milk. It's okay. It's very sweet and fruity, but you do get a hint of the... Um, I don't want to say it's bitterness, but of that grassiness towards the end of the sip. It's pretty good. It's a nice sweet tea. Um, it's not, I don't think it's going to be a favorite tea, but it's a tea that I do enjoy having once in a while. So today we are actually opening a new sub. It is called the Curl Crush. You can get it in a monthly mailer like this, which is $15 a month, or you can get it in a seasonal box, which is $60 a season. Doesn't seem to save much. It's $59.99. Won't save much, basically. Uh, I do think the seasonal, I'm not actually not sure. The seasonal might have more full sizes or something in it. Um, but this is primarily sample sizes, which is one of the reasons why I want to go ahead and try it. As I noted before, one of the reasons I stopped curl box was because we had way too many full sizes and I no longer had any room in my bathroom for them. So I figured the sample sizes would be a good one to try. I will say I am not a fan of the little gel packs, especially when they make them difficult to open but we'll take a look at this, this in a minute. In addition to that, I am also, I think, I believe I mentioned in my um, updated hair care routine that uh, I was looking for things to replace some of my Diva Curl because Diva Curl is so expensive. So one of the other things that came in today, I actually picked up from Walmart and it is the Jane Carter Solution Love Your Hair Condition and Sculpt Smooth Curling Prep Gel. I wanted to try this uh, to replace the light, um, the light hole gel that I've been using from Diva Curl. However, as you can see, this is a real watery formula, so this can be interesting to try. I have two others that I'm looking into as well to try. Um, biggest problem I'm thought having when I'm looking for a gel to replace the gel from Diva Curl is that most of them are like firm or ultra firm hold type gels and I do really want something that's light. I don't need any stiff, sticky, crunchiness in my hair basically. Um, I just need something that'll help the curl form and hold the curl without um, falling apart later but without all that you know stiff this is your curl's gonna be like this no matter what. Um, if that makes sense, <laughs> any kind of sense at all. Uh, so, but I'm going to give this a try and see how this works in place of the Diva Curl, if my hair even likes it. And, uh, yeah, we'll see how that goes. So that's that. And now we will open our little mailer as I look around to see if I need scissors just in case they're here. But hopefully the mailer will be easy to open. Oh, yes. It's a little pink mailer. Very similar to the Ipsy Mailers. Now, there is something large in here, so but I'm going to see if there's any cards. I have no idea what's in this month's bag, um, and I do not know if I'm going to be trying to uh, be doing the bag more than once. Okay, I'm not feeling any little cards. So, we'll pick out the big item first. So, our large item is the Avalon... The Science of Hair Care, Care Care Dry and Inchy Anti Dandruff Moisturizing Shampoo. Um, 
I'm not even sure I'm going to try this. One, I don't need another shampoo. I have a ton of shampoos. Two, I don't have dandruff. Um, I don't know anything about Care Care, so um, I'll have to think about it. I might try it once, but we'll see. We'll see. But that's that. Let's see what you smell like. If I can open you. I am kind of congested today. I'm still dealing with the... Oh, it has a safety seal. That's nice. I am dealing with a sinus infection, and they've given me meds for it. But yeah, I'm having some issues today. So if I do a lot of sniffling, I apologize. Oh, that's pretty. And it's blue. It's the color of the bottle. I don't know if you're going to be able to see that on the thing. Yeah, see? It's the color of the bottle. Feels thick. Feels very thick, actually. Has a touch of almost graininess to it, I would say, which is something I've noticed in other uh, anti dandruff shampoos. I don't know if they basically, I don't have a thing up here. I don't know if they basically um, exfoliate the scalp and that's how they get rid of the dandruff or whatever, but I'm, I've noticed that in other dandruff shampoos. Um, I will, I guess I will try it once or twice and see how it goes, but I am unlikely to keep this just merely because it's, you know, it's not a shampoo that I honestly am, um, likely to really need all that much. So, all right. So the rest of this feels like gel packs and it feels like they put a little bonus thing in here. So let's open up and see what our bonus thing is. Our little bonus thing is a pick. It is a standard pick. It's a little black one. Um, I actually much prefer I actually much prefer my Cantu pick, which has the uh, wavy wide. But you know what? My granddaughter might be able to use that when she's over here visiting. She has uh, type four hair, I believe. The rest of these feel like gel packs or little foil packs. So let's take a look and see what they say. So the first thing they sent was a Diva Curl Ultra, Ultra Defining Gel. Um, this is one of those stiff hold ones. I do think I have some samples somewhere. I will hold on to the sample back, though. It's not. They're expensive enough that that's something you want to keep. Next, we have another Diva Curl. Another Ultra Defining Gel. So they sent us two packages of the Ultra Defining Gel. And then we have... This is Madam C.J. Walker Beauty Culture Scalp and Strand Nourishing Dream Come True Wonderful Deep Conditioning Mask. Say that 15 times fast. Um, again, it's a, it's a pack in it. And just talks about how deep conditioning and rehydrating with a treatment mask Delivers a boost to dry, damaged, or color-treated hair. Improves hair health and manageability with every use. After shampoo, section hair from scalp to end. Saturate ends. Leave on for 15 minutes for deeper conditioning. Ply with moderate heat. Rinse thoroughly with cool water and style as desired. So it's a standard mask, although the 15 minutes is interesting because a lot of the masks I use now are three-minute masks, but 15 minutes is fine. We'll give that one a try. And last we have another mask. They sent me a full size shampoo and they sent two masks of the same mask and they sent two Diva Curl products. So it's a total of five items. One of them is a full size plus a pick. Plus a pick. So we got the pick too. Um, it's an interesting, it's an interesting subscription. I'll be honest, it's probably not a subscription I would keep. Uh, like I said, I don't like foil packs. Like, I already love Diva Curl, although the Ultra Defining Gel might be a bit too much for my hair. But I'll let you know. And I'll let you know about the um, Jane Carter Solutions Gel, too, as well. So that's it for the day. And I hope you like what you've seen and that you will, if you're not subscribed already, I hope you will subscribe. And if you do subscribe, I hope you hit that notification bell to know when I upload. I currently upload four days a week, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday. But we have bonus videos coming. Uh, the topic of some of them are already outside right now. My uh, plant boxes are outside. 
uh, and those will be getting more frequently as we go through the summer and then they will start to taper off until about October, November, somewhere in there. If you're already part of my notification squad, you'll want to check your bell and your subscription to make sure they're both still active. And if you don't want to subscribe, well, we would be very disappointed and sad. However, you're always welcome to come back again and visit us. We love having visitors come by. And if you do come by again, don't forget to bring your cup of tea. It's been in there for about 10 minutes or so. This bag didn't take that long. Now did it. So I'm going to go ahead and give it another taste. I suspect it's going to taste pretty close to the same, but let's give it a go. It's a little stronger. And actually some of that grassiness towards the end has faded out in favor of the actual mango passion fruit. It's a very good sweet tea. It's, it's a nice tea. So not a favorite, but it's a good tea. Anyway, you all have a great day.